Hello people, this is Sergio and today I'm going to talk about something different. I want to show you three different kinds of medicated uh, patches for normally pain in your back that I sometimes use, unfortunately. And I want to give you my impressions and advice. The first one I want to discuss is this Solampas. Uh, this this brand is is made in Japan here as you can see you can find it in any drugstore and also in uh, I buy them in Costco they have a big box and they sell them in, in bulk for a cheap price but normally you can find it in CVS or any place these are really good the only thing about these ones is that although they are good you can see this is the the indications and the content Comfort, metal, and methyl silicate. Although they are kind of good, the size of them is it's, it's pretty small. This is one of them I took out. So it comes like this, and this is one patch, and this is another patch. So it's very efficiently packed. Uh, they, are, they are kind of effective, but I have to say they are a little too small. So you have to put more than one normally, especially if you use it in your back. Now, the thing that I don't like about this patch that it's a pain in the butt. To take them out, the ink, or not the ink, the the glue that they use on this, I wouldn't say it's permanent, but it's it's pretty strong. So if you have any kind of hairs or you know any kind of hairs that you may have in the place that you're gonna apply this, there is gonna be they're gonna, the patch is gonna take them off. So you're gonna have also. Um, exfoliation treatment <laughs> with this and trust me it's kind of painful even on the shower with water it's, it takes time with soap to try to take this out so although these are good and effective I don't like its uh, painful removal now the second uh, I want to discuss is the icy hot medicated patch these are good and uh, it's the opposite of the Solampas um, they are good but instead of being small they are huge I just want to show you the ingredients so maybe I can save you a trip to the pharmacy and uh, this only has menthol 5% and I'll show you the patch, the patch is really big it will cover your, your whole uh, middle section or a side of your back now um, these patches are much easier to remove I would say they are smooth to remove um, but I do, I do have to say they are not as effective as the Solampas or the other patches Maybe it's because they only have been told, I'm uh, not sure, but it does feel like uh, a little fresh, you know, it's the sensation that you have when you put the icy hot cream. It's good, but you know, it's like a fresh sensation. And the advantage of this patch is its size, so you can cut it in half, so you can reuse it more. The, the back comes with five, so it's really ten, because this is really big, unless your pain extends for a long uh, area. So these are for the back. Now, this, the last ones I'm going to talk about, and my favorites, are the CVS Pharmacy Medicated Pain Pads. These are really good. This, the ingredient here is almost the same as the Solampas, as you can see. It has camphor, menthol, and methyl silicate. It's actually the same. So it's as effective as the Solampas. Uh, so, and I would say it's, they are much bigger. They are like maybe four or five times its size. This is the Solampas and this is this one. Now not only I think this is the best patch, the CVS one, I think also it's the easiest to remove in the back. As you see they are really soft and kind of cold but this removes in a snap. They don't pull any hairs, they don't make any discomfort and they, although it's easy to, they are easy to remove, they are also easy to attach and they stay put. So I don't know what kind of glue they use but it's really the best and I really recommend it. So I think the best for me is this CVS patch and the second and the close to this medicated patch is the Solampas. The disadvantage of the Solampas is, is that the patch is too small and the, and the glue is really too strong. Alright, I hope uh, I help you uh, a little bit with this video and thanks for watching.